Now, boys, don't get into any trouble while Mommy and Daddy are gone. And don't make a mess. Do you like parties? We can invite all our friends and have soda and pie. Yeah! I hope no bad people show up. Here's the problem. Five years ago, the previous commissioner started setting low priorities on storm drainage related projects. Why? Because our public works department through Lee Acey, who is now in prison on corruption violations, hired an environmental consulting company by the name of AMEC via a sole source bid at the tune of nearly three quarters of a million dollars to implement this program. AMAC has tried and failed to implement this same program in Pueblo County, El Paso County, and Douglas County. Commissioners, per your own admissions, this program is completely flawed. David Stallsworth, 8110 Brighton Road, DuPont, Colorado. I personally feel since our Adams County commissioners cannot hear anything we say, we need to start a recall uh, petition and see if we can improve their <laughs> originally scheduled to raise revenue by roughly $5.1 million for the 2013 budget. <coughs> Yet according to the 2013 budget, the county recommended hiring 77 full-time employees at an estimated cost of $5 million. I'm a retired resident living on a fixed income, as are many of my neighbors. I was at, in this room in February when someone asked the question, if you would repeal this fee. Your answer was, and I quote, I'm not interested, we need the money. According to the county's most recent combined annual financial report, I find you've collected from me and others an astonishing $151,781,348 unrestricted dollars. Correct me if I'm wrong. But unrestricted means that's money available to meet ongoing obligations to citizens. And all I wanted was to build a play area in my property. Well, I'm president of our nonpartisan grassroots organization, Stop Stormwater Utility Association. Our organization does not feel this is or should be a political issue. No lawsuit has been filed as of yet. But depending on the decisions you make today, that will be our next step. Sean Gallagher and Richard Murray are litigation attorneys with Pulsinelli PC in Denver, and they are here representing us. Sean will be glad to speak to everyone outside immediately following this meeting. Commissioners, we are asking you to put forth a motion, asking one of the other board members to second your motion, taking the fee portion of this stormwater funding off the table. Let me vote. Thank you. sure that we're not blocking the entrance over there getting in and out of the county building. Um, appre appreciate everybody coming today and your support in this whole thing. Um, at this time I'd like to turn it over to our attorney. You know people can make a case that there should be a stormwater fee just as people can make a case that there should not be a stormwater fee. I think the point of today's hearing is it should be the citizens of Adams County that make that decision, not the county commissioners. The temporary cap that they put on this fee is exactly that, temporary. Next year it'll go back to where it was or even higher to recoup what they lost this year. Um, I, for one, am not paying my fees for this year. I don't think this is right, and the treasurer has told us that if we don't pay them, we, she will not be putting liens on our properties, so I'm, I'm going with her statement. It's on three, let me vote. 
One, two, three. That's not loud enough. One, two, three. Let me vote!